A magnitude 7.0 earthquake rocked the city of Anchorage, Alaska today. Now, residents took cover as the ground shook and the roads caved in. Amy Mangold talked with Newburgh native Kristen Arnold, who now lives in Anchorage. Amy? Brett and Shelley, Kristen Arnold has lived in Alaska for a few years now, and she tells me they're used to earthquakes in the state. But this one was, in her words, strong. The earthquake, earthquake struck around 8.30 this morning, causing chaos and confusion. Streets buckled, windows were blown out of storefronts, and ceilings caved in, including parts of one in this Anchorage television station. A tsunami warning was also issued for several hours. Arnold tells me she was leaving her home heading to work when it struck. Uh, and my car started shaking really badly, and I didn't quite know what was happening. And I got out, and the ground was shaking. Everything was shaking. Um, it lasted for quite some time. And finally it stopped, and I realized it was an earthquake, and um, that, I mean, that's what happened. It was really, it was really scary. Arnold says she only had minor damage, items knocked over, the refrigerator displaced, and some cracks, but thankfully her neighborhood is sound and her friends are all safe. The governor has issued a state of emergency as work, crews work to assess the damage and begin to repair the roads. Now There have already been aftershocks, one registering 5.7. Those tremors may continue for the next few weeks or months. In the newsroom, Amy Mangold, Eyewitness News.